Welcome back. Summer has come and gone and there's no better way to celebrate the start of the fall season than by checking out some of the beautiful colors of Michigan's trees. And we'll show you today you could even win some fabulous prizes just by doing that. Today we are joined by Jill Halpin, founder and chief beach officer at My Michigan Beach, here to tell us about all of the fabulous fall in Michigan. Good morning, Jill. Thanks so much for joining us. Good morning, Lauren. Thanks for having me. So as we are now on the second day of fall, tell me a little bit about what people can expect um, for last minute trips and where they can plan to to go to. Oh my gosh, fall's my favorite time to travel in Michigan. Less crowds, seems to be a little bit more relaxed and we're so fortunate in Michigan, especially this year, the weather's been warm. I'm hearing it looks like it may, it may stick around a little bit. As you know already, just from looking around in, in your area, fall is just beautiful. Fall foliage, when the color lights up, it's just stunning. And we have so many great places where you can check it out. Um, some of my favorite places to check it out are um, Mears, Michigan, Little Sable Point, not too far from Grand Rapids. It's, it's, it's a nice drive, but there's an isolated stretch of Lake Michigan Beach with gorgeous, gorgeous foliage there. It's just stunning. Um, I also like Akiak Falls, it's the only fall, it's the only waterfall in Lower Peninsula, in the Lower Peninsula, stunning area. Um, it's ADA accessible, so there's beautiful paths that wind through the woods. Um, Cadillac is a great place to go. Um, small town, lakes, forest, I mean, what else do you need, right? Oh yeah, and we're taking a look at some of the beautiful video there um, that was just being shown and you can see some of those colors and a lot of people love to visit Michigan because of the peak colors that we see here in our area. I understand you have a peak uh, foliage map on your website that people can look at, um, but in your opinion, when are the best times to see some of those colors throughout Michigan? So you really, our map, we update it regularly, we kind of watch the weather reports and we've got people who are sort of parked in special places throughout the state to give us an update. Um, it's really starting now in the Upper Peninsula and peak color, remember these are just predictions, but peak color means when the colors, when almost all the trees are lit up. Um, you know, it's kind of this rare time, it's like a week or two week period. But even though the peak colors are really important, you can take a look at that map and kind of get an idea of when the color is really starting to appear. So it gives you an idea of how to plan your trips, whether it's a day trip, a road trip. And then we've also got some suggestions on that peak fall color map of things you might do in each area too. And now I understand if people go on your website and they share some of their favorite spots to visit this fall um, or see some of those colors, they could win a golf giveaway, which is so exciting. So tell us a little bit about that and how people can maybe um, apply to those sweepstakes. Yes, we're so excited about this. It's our fabulous fall giveaway. Um, it's, it's three rounds of golf at three different courses in Cadillac with an overnight stay, breakfast is included, and then a $100 gift card to kind of explore the town, dine. And what we're doing is asking people to go to mymichiganbeach.com. You'll find a link to go ahead and sign up for that and enter the sweepstakes there. It runs all week. All right, Jill, well, thank you so much for all the great information. We are so excited for the season, especially here in Michigan. Thank you for joining us this morning. Thank you so much for having me. And just a reminder, those sweepstakes do run through the 30th. You can find all those details on our website, fox17online.com.